like I said, the pot full of outcropping right here. Oh, we just do our cropping, just digging around. And we smooth this out a little bit. A little. Lift it up like that, just peel it off. It, uh, so fairly easy. A little bit of a nice area here. Let me put some bushes or trees all through there. And let's get a little bit more, more vertical this cliff. I'm going to have a little bit of a dangerous cliff in here. You know, we're gonna have hikers come up in here, you know, this is gonna be a park, which it actually is gonna be a park to a certain extent. And hikers come up here and they get to see all the trains. But you know, they gotta watch out for the scary drop right here. Yeah, you know, it hurt. <laughs> Careful. <laughs> so white metal small white knuckle clip and I actually have a bigger clip over there which I'm gonna plan on having people propelling down it. And as I was looking at uh, what I done yesterday, I kind of felt or saw another beam coming on here. So I'm gonna get some beams here. right in here, a little water drain off. angle of what's going on here. Let's see what's going on.
steps in here. I'm just kind of step in a little bit. Let's right here. And again, you, know, okay, you can kind of see the line where the two pieces of foam meet, but we'll fill these in with the spackling. Once you paint it over, you won't see that. And that's what I'll uh, do in a later video shot. How to tie these lines so it's not quite uh, obvious. Body here. there for some trees to grow and kind of break the monotony. some plaster castings, plaster castings here, these are the boulders sticking up.